we're in Kansas City. We're not supposed to be in Kansas City, but we're in Kansas City. Uh, if you saw last week's video, uh, we got here a little bit early, so now we're taking advantage of the sights and sounds of Kansas City. And right now we're on top of the tower at the World War I Museum. We're going to share a bunch of that with you. But we're looking forward to, uh, we're a little bummed that we got kicked out of Branson a little early. <laughs> but uh, it's cool, because we're in Kansas City now. Yeah, it's cool. So, let's go check it out. Today we're at the Money Museum in Kansas City, which is ironic because we love money. We do. Big fan. Big fan of money. <laughs> The closest there, we'll ever be to that, forty million dollars. For real, <laughs> it's right there. You can't. And then the half a million dollar gold bar. Yeah, that's which crazy. you could touch, but you couldn't get it. It's <laughs> crazy. It's almost torturous to be that close to all it, that money. It is. I don't know how they work here. I don't either. I, I couldn't. But it's fun to see, and it's free. So mm -hmm. if you have a, uh, uh, um, what is it? It's just a, uh, a Federal, Federal Reserve, Reserve Bank. So if you have a Federal Reserve Bank near you go see it it's free it's pretty high security to get in the joint yeah I mean they if you have warrants I wouldn't recommend I wouldn't, they scan your your ID and your yep. driver's license to get in and then you go through the metal detector bring your cameras don't bring your guns there's a sign it says no guns no knives so no pepper spray none of that stuff <laughs> but um, if you got warrants might want to skip the the Federal Reserve Bank it's probably gonna skip it anyway <laughs> <laughs> like, dude, can I see it before you take me downtown? You're already downtown. It's a short trip to the station. We passed the police we did, we station, guys, right, right down the street, so it'd be a short oh, trip. So if you got warrants, pass. <laughs> it seems as though more and more of our videos are ending up in graveyards. Yeah. Yeah. We just went to the bank where Jesse James, Jesse James didn't arrive. He Frank, orchestrated it. Yeah, Frank and... And the gang. Uh, the gang. <laughs> The Jesse James was like the James gang. He was like the brains. Yeah. He wasn't actually at the robbery, but He's Frank mastermind. James robbed the bank. We saw saw that, and so now we're coming out to the Jesse James grave. Yeah. And then when we get down here, we're gonna go out to, to the, the farm, the farm. where he used James to live, farm. James farm. This is pretty cool. We're at the uh, the grave of of uh, Jesse James, Jesse James' wife, and on either side of of his grave is his mother and his stepfather and his uh, stepbrother who's over here and his stepbrother was killed by a bomb because uh, detectives were trying to hunt down Frank and Jesse James. They thought that they were at the farm but they were not and they threw a bomb through the window which killed Archie Samuel which was Frank and Jesse James' stepbrother and also blew off the hand of his mother. Mangled her arm so bad that it had to be amputated. So. It's cool to see uh, the graves of all of them out here, and now we're going to head out to the farm.
They say this place is haunted. I you might feel a touch. If the door slams behind you, don't pay attention to it. Oh, <laughs> Go in! No! Go in! It's creepy. This is a cell. Let me help you with this door. Just don't shut the door. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just shut it halfway. No, don't shut it. <laughs> Lay down, stick your head out. I'm not putting my head in. <laughs> They didn't stick. Oh my gosh. on Sunday yeah. went to NASCAR race. Yeah. Which was the reason that brought us here in the first place. <laughs> Well, we're wrapping up Kansas City, and w w there was way more to do here than I thought there was going to be. Yeah, there's still more to do. Yeah, we actually... We didn't do all of it. <laughs> we're a little bummed because we came here early from Branson thinking we'd have to try to find some stuff to do. Some extra stuff, yeah. We didn't have a problem. No, not at all. Plenty of stuff to do. We First, we met up with uh, Jerry and Kelly from mm -hmm. Dallian Adventures, and they're locals. So they took us around and showed us a bunch of stuff. Yep. The first weekend. Yeah. And then again on the second weekend. The first weekend we uh, we went down to the World War One Museum and the Anderson House, which is mm -hmm. a little bit of like war history for Kansas yep. City, which we're gonna do in a separate video from this one. Mm -hmm. We went down to Union Station, which is the old train depot. Train, yes. They have some shopping and stuff down there, but more importantly, Kansas City barbecue. Yeah. <laughs> it took us to a place called Jack Stack, and it was really good. Yeah. Like, really, really good. good. But then during the week, we found some other cool stuff to do. We went over to the Money Museum. That was cool. Ha! Huh. Oh, so cool. If you haven't seen the Instagram or the Facebook posts <laughs> that we that put was up. A neat place. We took a selfie with $40 million. $40 million. <laughs> I knew you were going to do that. <laughs> I knew it. You don't know what I'm I going to do. I always know what you're going to do. <laughs> Then we went 
uh, the next weekend we got together with uh, Jones. Jones and Two Travel, mm -hmm. Aaron and Tina from Jones and Two Travel. So that was our second YouTuber meetup, link up yeah. while we were here in Kansas City. Wonderful which, couple. Awesome. Had an awesome time with them. Yeah. And uh, we did collaboration with both of those mm -hmm. channels, with Galleon Adventures and with Jones and Two Travel. So you'll see those videos coming up soon. Both couples were just really. Yeah fun couples to be around. And yeah, it's kind of depressing to leave now. It is. Well, Jones and the Travel already left. <laughs> they, yeah, they left. They're Saturday. down in Arkansas now, yeah. but it's depressing to leave from here. And But we have some other people that we're already scheduled yeah. to link up with along the way, so we're looking forward to that, too. Yeah. Um, we went the next weekend with Galleon Adventures again to the hockey game on Friday night. Yeah. There's a local hockey team here, the uh, Kansas City Mavericks. Mm -hmm. who were on a losing streak until we showed up <laughs> so we uh we went ahead and took care of that uh, yeah. and uh got, got them back win. on track <laughs> they won five to one and now they're good to go we mm -hmm. can leave here and they can they can uh, go ahead and take it from here so you're welcome <laughs> kansas city for getting your hockey team back on track yeah. if you ever need us again just give us a call we'll come we'll back come in back. we'll go to the hockey game we'll square all this away mm -hmm. and then we'll be on our way yeah. again yeah yeah <laughs> Okay. But the race was great. Um, that was a fun race. It started good with, you know, sunshine. And yeah, it was it really got, windy. Yeah. But the sun was shining, so it balanced it out. But then it got cold. Then it got, yeah. Because there was the Cloud clouds. Coverage came. And then the sun got behind the grandstand, so our portion of the grandstand was in the shade. Yeah. Toward the end of the race. And we were, we were pretty cold. Yeah. But she had to go buy another sweatshirt. Not only the race came down to the wire, but it was an elimination race where they're going from 12 drivers in the playoffs to eight drivers in the playoffs. Your guy was on the bubble yeah. all day. He was, me nervous. he was four <laughs> points out, three points out. Then he was like two, two points, points in and two points out. And it came down to the, there was a wreck right at the, right at the yeah. end that caused the caution. And we didn't know if your guy was going to make it mm -mm. or not. And he almost even won the race. He almost did. He ended up finishing second in the race, mm -hmm. and which put him two points to the good in the transfer spot. Mm -hmm. My guy finished ninth, but he was already in the transfer yeah. spot. Lauren's guy finished third, but he was already in the transfer spot. So all of our guys ended up making it through to the yeah. tran to transfer to the to the final eight in the NASCAR playoffs, and um, and we got to see Denny Hamlin win the race. Yeah, but I like Denny. And which is cool. Denny's cool. So guy. Denny's a good dude. So yeah. um, it was a good race. It was a good race. It was a good time, and we got to meet. Um, Two great YouTube channels. Yeah. So we'll put links to the descriptions. Uh, we'll put links to their channel in the description here and look for them in the future because we're going to do some collaboration videos. Well, we've already done the collaboration yeah. videos, but we're going to edit them and put them up on the channel. So we hope that you uh, like that. We had a great time in Kansas City. We'll be back. Yeah, absolutely. Man, uh, I enjoyed Kansas City way more than I thought that I would. Mm-hmm. Me too. It was a pleasant surprise. And uh, a lot of fun. A beautiful city. Very beautiful city. Great skyline. Yeah. Easy to navigate through. Traffic's yeah. not terrible. I think that's a wrap for Kansas City. Yeah. And like we do every week, we're gonna honor a fallen hero, and we appreciate you guys watching because it helps us help veterans. We're really, yeah. really close to giving away some more money. Yes. We're, we're looking for a place. We, we have the money. We need to do we're gonna it. we're gonna look for a place, and we're gonna give away some money to some veterans. Yes. And uh, we hope that you will stick around and watch that with us too. And we'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.